Hi everybody, Bill here. Welcome back to another awesome day, another awesome vlog. Today's the first day it hasn't been raining. The sun's getting ready to set. I want to go out and see what the neighborhood looks like. This is mostly going to be a point of view video. So let's go see what we can find. I'm so happy the rain is over. Let's go. Well, as I walk out the door, the moon is out. But it's still daylight. Let's see if we can go get the sunset. And there's an airplane. Hi, Ava. Yeah. <laughs> Next stop, the mailbox. Something in there. All right, let's try this again. I think I'm showing our address everywhere. <laughs> we get mail from Hellsburg now because this is where I bought Lisa's diamond, her 10-year anniversary diamond ring. So now we get a lot of mail from them. And we got some package for Lisa. Let's open it up and see what it is. Alfred's made it on the vlog. And we opened up the box and it looks like Lisa got some makeup. I don't know what that is though. Lip liner, mascara, what's your guess? Uh, lip gloss. It says lip gloss on it? Mm-hmm. All right. All right, let's continue on. All right, I got an entourage now. Lip gloss? Uh, <laughs> she almost, is she it tried your lip putting gloss? makeup on me, but luckily there was no makeup for my face, so yeah. All right. Well, when California gets water, it turns green. Oh, the frogs are getting ready to go. The sun has already gone down. There we go, that's a better shot. A little less overexposed. Beautiful sky. The grass isn't so green. Whenever it gets cold here, the grass turns a lighter green for the winter. <laughs> At least it's not under 12 feet of snow. We are lucky to live in a beautiful area. The water flows down through here. I'm gonna go see how much of it there is. It's muddy. Trucks are coming through. People actually live out past our neighborhood, out this dirt road, out onto the farmland. Well, I don't know if you can see it out there, that that's Mount San Jacinto, home of Idlewild. Has some snow on the top of it. Let me change exposure and see if we can see it better. Can we see it any better? Snow on the mountain. It's trying to turn green. There's a road over here is where you hear all the cars. Oh, guy on his four-wheeler coming out. We have our water back. It comes from way out there. Flows through here flows under the bridge and then the golf course on the other side becomes a river. I'll hike over there and show you that. The frogs love this. Usually we can walk across here but I'm gonna have to go up on the street and walk across but I hear the water flowing over. Can you hear the water flowing over? The other side of the bridge, it goes downhill and goes to the golf course. Alright, let's hike up there. Alright, I wanted to hurry and get off the bridge. Cars are going by really quick. But I wanted to show you the other side. So the water flows out through those trees and down to the golf course out there. I'm gonna head that way. Just up at the end of the water, they're kind of leaving. They're afraid of the, afraid of me. They're afraid of the camera. They're camera shy. I don't know if you can see them or not. But that's the water coming from the bridge. Hits these culverts. Comes underneath the golf course uh, cart path. And it heads out that way on the golf course. The golf course is flooded. 
And that's just the fairway of the golf course that the water flows through. Hey babies, can I get your picture? I think you can see them now. Alright, and that heads all the way down to uh, Newport Road through uh, Minifee Lakes. I hope this water goes into the one of the lakes down there and it's just not going underground and being wasted someplace. But let's head back. I'm about, I don't know, I've probably gone uh, three quarters of a mile away from home. It's getting dark enough the frogs are starting to come out. Even at the park closest to our home where I first showed you the water on the other side of the bridge, we get thousands of frogs. It's a frog chorus all night. That's my neighborhood out yonder at the base of that hill. Well, I don't know if you'll be able to see it or not, but right to the left in the middle of the four hills out the back, there's a mountain with snow on the top and that's Mount San Gregorio. And on the other side of the front face of that mountain is where Big Bear is. I'm sure there's good skiing up there this weekend. Lots of, hey, here comes Lisa. Be careful on the bridge. Get off the bridge. Get off the bridge with the cars coming. Hi, honey. How are you? I can't believe all the water. Yeah, it goes all the way out the golf course. Oh my gosh, it's just flowing like a river. Yeah. You made it home. Yeah. Hi. Hi. I love you. Smoochie, smoochie. Mm, love you. I love you too. Be careful going across the bridge. Okay. That's why I picked him up too. All right. Let's head back. Okay. All right. We've made it back across the bridge. Back to the park at our neighborhood. Lisa came and found me. Yeah. Start Riley on a little walk. we got to watch the... Warriors. Warriors versus the Clippers game tonight. Why do we want to watch that? Because we need the Warriors to win to bump the Clippers down to bump the Lakers up. That's exactly <laughs> right. Lights are coming on. Yep. Let's go make some dinner. Let's go. Street, street lights are coming on. What does that mean? Time to go in. She knew it. She's almost as tall as me standing on the <laughs> ottoman. All right, everybody. Hope you like my POV video of our neighborhood checking out the water and everything. We got some good rain, but tomorrow should be sunny and in the 70s. Where are you going? Disneyland. It's time to go back to Disneyland. Oh, yeah. All right, good night, everybody. Bye.